Yourself, sir, and how you feel today, and what the preparation has been done for this? All sanitization procedures, all protocols have been followed. We are taking students as they come in, and all the classrooms are sanitized, and we have staggered the students to come at different times. What the arrangement, sitting arrangement that have been done in the classes? Six feet between students, only 12 students per class. How many students are strength is there? Each, each class? No, total is strength here. Yeah. Total strength is 150. 150. How do you feel that uh, your school has been restarted with students with SOPs? See, we are very happy that we have... Master. We are very happy today. And when we see the children coming inside the school, they are also happy and we are also happy. And as our headmaster and as well as high secondary principal, they have given their views we have done all the arrangements and we have taken all the precautions. Hope everything goes on well with God's help. We are praying that everything may go on well and may God bless each one of us and keep us, all of us, safe and sound. Thank you. I'm teacher Ann Lisa Pinto from uh, Santa Cruz High School. Uh, we are very uh, happy that uh, the school is being reopened. Uh, we're happy that we can educate our students and help them with their difficulties in whatever way possible. And since they're 10th standard students, uh, we are sure that uh, we'll be able to keep them in track and we'll be able to take all the possible precautions. So we are happy in all the way possible that the education minister has decided to open the school. Yeah. What are the preparations that and what are the tasks that have been given by the management? Yeah, so the first thing that we were told is to see that we uh, see that the child when they enter are uh, sanitize their hand, check their temperature. These are basic precautions and the main thing that we have to keep in mind is to make the child understand that uh, to keep social distance. It's going to be a little bit difficult because children have been uh, waiting to get back to school that's going to be a difficulty for us to see that they maintain the social distance throughout the day uh, of, uh, since they'll be in the campus uh, from the morning till the noon time so hopefully we can see that we don't end up in any other further crisis so that's our meaning i'm Sadwin fernandez i'm in 10th and i'm from santa cruz high school remove your mask now Mask, mask, mask. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, how do you feel to be back in school now? Uh, like I'm very happy to see my all my friends and my teacher. Like for so many months we were studying online classes and now I'm happy to come to school. And I'm like, due there is a many uh, 
pandemic situation, but still, I'm happy to come. Uh, how do you feel? It was better online, or do you feel like it will be better in the school? It was better, but like in school, it's better to getting like lectures from teachers and all. Online, it used to used to have network problem and many issues like that. So it was sometimes for not audible and something. You're happy now, man. Yeah. Your name is it? Sorry? Your name? My name is Edwin Fernandez. Yeah. Sir Sandeep Kaur. No. Mas. Louder. Yeah. And my name is Ansika Sandeep Kaur. I'm from Sandeep High School. So, so how you feel being back in school after? I feel happy. It's nice to be with the friends, school, everything. Was it better online or do you wanted to be back in with the teachers? It's okay, but still, uh, interaction with teachers is better than online classes. Thank you. So just tell us uh, from today the schools have been started 10th standard new school. So what are the preparation has been done and what is it? Well today it's very nice to see students reporting to school. Uh, we have called students today in two batches. Okay. And uh, we'll be having uh, the assembly uh, after maintaining social distancing and following, uh, following the protocols. Uh, we have taken utmost care to see that uh, all SOPs are implemented in the school and whatever we have prepared at this reopening day is in the best interest of the students. Keeping in mind uh, about the COVID-19 pandemic, we have taken all precautionary measures. We are very happy to see that the students are entering the school and they are walking in with confidence. Probably they are also very happy to be back in school and uh, along with my manager, we have or rather we are well prepared to receive our students on the first day of now, the reopening. Uh, what's the arrangement that have made to the classes? How many students? Well, we have about 163 students and from Monday onwards we are going to follow a timetable that has been prepared with 12 students in each classroom. We have seven blocks and the students will be reporting to school on alternate days. Okay, this is being done uh, in terms of the circular issued by the Directorate of Education. We are following the guidelines strictly. Uh, your name and uh, I'm Russell Kutino, headmaster of Santa Cruz High School. So introduce yourself, sir. What is exactly and how you feel to be getting student back to school? Today is the first day of the reopening. We are happy to be there. And the students have come and they are showing a good response. We have made all the precautions. Uh, we have taken all the precautions necessary uh, to put the SOPs in place. And we are limiting each class to 12 students. Thank you. Uh, how many is the, what is the strength of the students? Our strength is uh, about 150 students. About 10 to 12. 